Tape at the wheel, new details in Tiger Woods' DUI arrest. We've obtained the police report. It supports his story. There was no alcohol involved. Tiger Woods' DUI stems from narcotics he had in his system. We now know Jupiter police found Woods asleep at the wheel, buckled up with his car running in the middle of the road. Channel 4's Lindsay Gardner has been looking through the report. Lindsay. And Bruce, in the last 10 minutes, I've also just obtained Tiger Woods' complete driving history in the state of Florida. He is listed as a safe driver. In fact, the only crash recorded is the infamous one following a fight with his now ex-wife in 2009. The DUI hasn't even shown up on this record yet, but no other tickets are listed either. I can also tell you Woods passed not one but two breathalyzer tests during his DUI arrest early Monday morning. He was cited for driving while on narcotics after admitting to taking three drugs and being prescribed a fourth. It is not clear if all four were in his system. Police found Woods asleep in his black Mercedes around 2 to 3 a.m. with the car on. The officer actually had to wake him up. They documented Woods had extremely slow, slurred speech and was cooperative but confused and couldn't even walk alone or keep his eyes open. Woods told police he was coming from Los Angeles on a golfing trip, then changed his story a few times, and even asked the officer for directions to his own home. We now know his house was about less than 10 miles away. He was given four field sobriety exercises, failed three of them, including a walking test and the finger-to-nose test. He was able to recite the alphabet after first misunderstanding the officer, thinking he was to, quote, recite the national anthem backward. Now, we do know that Tiger Woods will be in court coming up in July. He was released on his own recognizance following his arrest yesterday. Now, he also released a statement apologizing to his fans, thanking the officers for their professionalism, and adding that this was all the result of an unexpected reaction to prescribed medications. Of course, Bruce, we're working the very latest on this, and we'll have more coming up tonight at 5. Lindsay, thank you for a look at the arrest report and new information. Go to newsforjags.com.